third graders? This week, our spelling words are suffixes. So, a suffix is kind of like a prefix. We learned about prefixes last week. Prefixes come at the beginning of the word, but suffixes come at the ending of a word. It changes the base word's original meaning. So you can see there's a list over here of common suffixes and their meanings. So the spelling words this week are thankful, careless, faster, lately, happiness, infection, movement, and our red words that are difficult to sound it out and they're really great to just memorize. These are the words says, that, there. Now, I'm gonna switch my camera to my document camera so that you can see me writing these words as well. Back to the word thankful. I am thankful for my third grade students. Thankful. Number two, careless. If you rush with your work, you may make a careless mistake. Number three, faster. The more we practice, the faster we get. Number four, lately. Lately, I've been so proud of my third graders' progress. Number five, happiness. When you feel joy, sometimes happiness comes right along with it. Number six, infection. I hope I don't have an infection. Infection. Number seven, movement. The more movement you have, the more healthier your body will be. Now, I wanted you to see that the endings are the suffixes here. So I'm gonna come back and underline the suffixes and only the suffix part of the word. So F-U-L is the suffix for thankful. L-E-S-S -S is the suffix for careless. E-R for faster. L-Y is the suffix in the word lately. N-E-S-S -S is our suffix for happiness. T-I-O-N is the suffix for infection. And mint is the suffix for movement. Let's look at those red words. Those are kind of like sight words. Sometimes we call them high frequency words. They're tricky to sound out. The first one is says. If she says to do it, I better do it. Says. Number nine. That. I see that spaceship in the sky. Do you see it too? Number 10. There. Now I see the spaceship. It's right over there. There are your 10 spelling words for the week, kiddos. On Friday, I'll give you a test over these 10 words. Have a wonderful day.